Hi guys, thank you so much for watching. Today's video is going to be sort of a, sort of like a pinupy look, um, some classic red lips and a bold uh, liner. So I'm going to take you through all the steps to recreate this look on yourself. So let's get started. I'm going to start off with a little bit of Fix Plus to sort of moisturize my skin because it's rather dull. And just let that absorb into the skin. Okay, once that's settled in, I'm going to use a primer. I have a sample of one, actually. This one's called Foundation Primer Radiance by Laura Mercier. For this look, I want my skin to look radiant and be flawless. So, I'm going to use a primer today. Whoa, that was a lot. So, I'm going to use the Revlon Nearly Naked in 150 Nude. I'm going to start, I'm going to use MAC Painterly Paint Pot, which is just a neutral cream shadow by MAC. And I'm just going to put this on with my finger. Up to the brow. So once you have your base on, let's start with eyeshadow. I'm going to take a fluffy brush and I'm using um, L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Eyeshadow in Endless Pearl. And it looks like that. It's just a neutral um, shadow. I'm going to put this all over the eye. Okay. Then I'm going to take eternal eternal sunshine and I'm going to take the same brush take a little bit of that and then put this on the center of the eye this is just to give it a little bit of shine the bronzer that I'm going to use is this but I'm just going to take a little bit of that with my same brush the same fluffy brush tap it off start putting this into the crease This will just add warmth to the eye without necessarily going in with a harsh shadow. So just buff that out. Bring it out as far as you want. I'm just going to keep mine right a little bit above the crease. Just a tad. <laughs> just a tad. So I'm going to go in with the, the Naked Basics palette. And I'm going to take... Um, what should I take? I'm going to take a little bit of Naked. And a little bit of faint. Just a, t a tad. <laughs> just a little bit. Oh my lord, look at this hair. It's just not working. Okay, anyway. We're going to put that right here. For highlight, I'm going to use the Venus color in the, um, the Naked palette. That and then run that underneath the eye. I mean, underneath the eyebrow. And I'm going to put that in the inner corner. Now we are ready um, for eyeliner. I usually start in the middle of the eye. Now for this look, I do want a really intense line so I'm really gonna extend out so all I do is I follow the natural curve of my eye so I, I follow I line it up with the bottom and I just draw a line there So I'm going to curl my lashes. I'm going to use my Ardell Demi, 120 Demi, and the Duo uh, Dark Tone. Let these dry for a sec. And I'm just going to blend them in 
with some mascara. Like, blend in my um, natural lashes with the fake ones. And I'm just going to put a little mascara. So I'm going to take my concealer. I'm using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NW20. And the waterline, I'm going to use um, a nude liner, eyeliner. And this will just really open up the eye. And this is the Stila Kajal Eyeliner in Topaz. I'm going to take a pencil brush and run a little bit of the... Um, the faint color just right underneath it mascara on the bottom lash now I'm going to contour um, and bronze the skin for that I'm going to use I think this is actually a, bl a blush it's called Blunt by MAC and it's very, as you can see, it's very dark. So I just take the smallest bit, just dip my brush in there once, and start contouring. So I'm going to do my eyebrows real fast. Now for the fun part, the lips. I'm going to take a lip liner. Um, MAC Red Lip Liner, R-E-D-D, -D, and I'm going to line my lips with this. And I'm going to fill it in with um, MAC Russian Red, which is a matte lipstick, and it looks like this. I'm going to take um, this... Whisper of Guilt Extra Dimension Skin Finish by MAC, which is gorgeous. I'm going to take some of that and run that on the tops of the cheekbones. And a little bit on top of the eyebrow. I run that down my nose. I'm going to take a little bit of shroom and I'm going to put that right here. I'm going to take a little bit of the Hourglass Extreme Sheen Lip Gloss in Siren. I'm just going to put that in the middle of the lip. Sorry, the camera stopped recording. So all I finished doing was I sprayed my face with some Fix Plus and I let that dry. And then I went in with my uh, NARS Translucent Crystal Light Reflecting Setting Powder. And I used a small brush like this and I just put it in the places that I didn't want to be uh, shiny uh, or oily on. So I just right here, down the nose, right here, and underneath where I put the concealer. And then I also added a little bit of the Reflex Gold. Um, MAC pigment and I took a small brush like this and all I did is that I set it down right there just on the middle of the eye just for a little bit um, for a little bit of sparkle so this is the final look and I hope that you enjoyed it and I will see you in my next video bye